The following portion of Daytime is sponsored by Orthopedic Medical Group of Tampa Bay. The knee is a hard working joint, and if you're dealing with a severe injury or arthritis, you may need total knee replacement surgery. Orthopedic Medical Group of Tampa Bay has surgeons who can perform the most advanced techniques in joint replacement, including robotic assisted. Here to tell us more is Dr. Germanuel Landfair. Doctor, welcome. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. So this is cool, robotic assisted. What does the robot actually do? Well, I think one thing that is important to distinguish is what the robot doesn't do. A lot of my patients actually come to me and they say, oh, I want you to do my surgery. I don't want the robot to do it. What the robot does is it actually helps us with planning and they actually perform the cuts, but we are actually still in control of the robot while performing the cuts. And it also gives us boundaries that we can't go outside of and it keeps you safe because there's some things we don't want to be cutting on as well. So it enhances it, it doesn't Correct. replace. I think that's such a good point, I'm glad yeah. you made it. So tell us what's in store for the patient. Let's talk through the process preoperatively. What, what, are they, what can they expect? I think beyond the normal preoperative process with um, seeing their primary care physicians or any other co um, consultants that they may need to make sure that they're okay to go through with the actual surgery. Right. What the robotic, at least the robotic system that we use in our um, in our uh, office, well, I should say in our ORs, mm -hmm. um, you have to get a, a CAT scan in order for us to have an idea of what the actual landmarks are. And I, I, I like the system just because it also, it, it tells us what your unique anatomy is, and it helps us with the planning process of seeing what, what things we, may, we will expect to see in the operating room, and then we can actually address those things and plan for them ahead of time. So it's about being thorough, which Correct. is really smart. So let's talk about what the surgery actually entails. You brought a model mm -hmm. of how this implant will sit on top of, of where it's being placed. Can yes. you show us? Yes, definitely. So here we have the femur bone, which is your thigh bone, and at the end of the femur is the, the I guess we would call it the proximal portion of your knee, and then here's your shin bone, T uh, technically called the tibia. And in between those two, that's what comprises your knee joint along with your kneecap, which is the patella, mm -hmm. right? And arthritis is when you have damage to the cartilage that are on the ends of those bones where they meet. And what we do is in order to get rid of that damaged cartilage, we have to take a small sliver of the bone along with it in order for us to be able to put the implants onto it securely. Okay, and then once we're done putting the metal implants, which are traditionally made of titanium, we put a, a high, you know, high grade medical um, type of plastic called polyethylene. Mm -hmm. And that serves as our new cartilage, really. It's the new gliding surface for all of the uh, metal implants that we put in place. That is fascinating. Yeah. And so what about recovery after the surgery? Is it pretty quick or is it intense? Ah. So recovery is actually pretty variable. It's kind mm. of dependent on the patient and their kind of biology, right? Okay. If the, uh, the thing I like to tell my patients is the more fit you are before surgery is probably going to determine how fast your recovery is. So if you come in and you're pretty debilitated, you're probably going to have a longer and slower recovery than somebody who came in. And, you know, even though they had knee arthritis, they were pretty, they maintained their activity levels, biked or as much as they could. Those people are usually going to have a, a much swifter um, recovery process. That makes sense. Yeah. So lastly, in our last seconds, if you need a total knee replacement, you say robotic is the way to go. I say robotic is the way to go, but we can do it both ways. Okay, <laughs> good. There you go. Something for everybody. Yes. Doctor, thank you. Appreciate you being here. Oh, no problem. Thank you for having me. And if you'd like more information on Orthopedic Medical Group of Tampa Bay, you can visit omgtb.com. Daytime, we'll be right back. The preceding portion of Daytime was sponsored by Orthopedic Medical Group of Tampa Bay.